Hey, what's up guys? The video that you're looking at right now, or the videos that you're looking at right now, uh, is basically a test that I did to show what is the result of turning anti-aliasing off in the PS3 version of Battlefield 3. For those of you guys who don't know, Battlefield 3 on the PS3 has been plagued by input lag. And input lag has nothing to do with the connection. If you guys want to know what input lag is, there's links in the description box below. But uh, these videos that you're watching right now, uh, the left one has anti-aliasing on while the right one has anti-aliasing off so you can see that for me it pretty much produces the same results but it seems that after the patch input lag seems to be reduced uh, a little bit which is actually a great thing because even the tiniest bit of input lag reduction can uh, improve the way the game feels in a dramatic way because even the slightest bit of input lag overdone because every game has input lag but if input lag has is too much in the game uh even by the slightest bit then it could really throw the game off and throw your aiming off and make it all feel wobbly and whatnot so with this video it shows proof that the patch did do something to help input lag but the issue is kind of still there so i'm hoping that dice continues to pursue uh this whole fixing input lag on the battlefield 3 ps3 version and I'm hoping that they succeed in the future. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video.